Welcome everybody to the third episode of the Cool Commits. How you guys doing today, man? Sure, it's Alec. We're at back to an episode. Today, we got a big commitment for the Florida Gators. We got Miles Graham, four-star uh, linebacker slash running back, 6'1", 200 pounds, out of Woodyard Academy High School in Atlanta, Georgia, out of the 2024 class. Currently, he's the 52nd player in the nation, second linebacker in the nation. And hey, man, let's let's get into it, man. But before I get into like his stats and everything like that, and his strengths that I saw um, from his film as a running back and as an outside linebacker, um, I just want to talk about some of the offers that he had. Uh, 38 offers coming into his commitment, Alabama, Arkansas, Auburn, Baylor, and Boston College. But he picked Florida out of those 38, and that is their first commitment of the 2024 class. So that's a huge commitment right there for them. Uh, just some background um, information. His father, Ernest Graham, he played uh, running back for the Florida Gators. Uh, Ernest Graham, like I said, I um, mean, he played eight seasons in the NFL for the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. So there's just some, you know, genes that he got from his dad for sure. Um, but hey, man, let's let's get in these strengths, man. I don't know where his um, I didn't see his stats anywhere, but hey, from what I saw, he's a baller anyway. Uh, so first off, like just out of his stat, out of his uh, strengths, like right off the bat, something that you'll see right away in his film is he's just a big hitter. Like, he, dude, once he once he initiates contact, he's like a brick wall. You're not getting past him. Like, it doesn't matter if it's in the run game or the pass game. Like, you're not going to get by him. Like, it's, it's just not going to happen. Um, and then he's next, he's good at run at reading the backfield. Uh, once he sees a run, he's he has really quick awareness uh, along with the speed and acceleration that really helps him to get back in the backfield really, really quickly for a sack or a tackle for loss. So that's a big thing right there. Um, and then next, he's great at ripping the ball away uh, during his big hits, which lead to turnovers as well um like i said like he once you once he initiates contact you're not getting anywhere and you know just to add on to it like i said like he's just great at stripping the ball and ripping that ball away to create more opportunities for his offense uh, to get back on the field and score the ball um and then another big another big strength is he has really good block shedding um i guess bigger players like offensive linemen things of that nature and that just goes right back to his good speed and acceleration because he, he's he's so quick they can't keep up with him um at least the competition he's playing obviously in in the uh in college football in the nfl later in his career you know there's gonna be obviously a lineman that deal with that all day every day um so we'll just have to keep you know leveling up his techniques to get by them uh, but from what i saw really good block shedding ability um which you know like i say compliments his good speed and acceleration um, the next, I think a really underrated thing with some players, like, you know, some uh, linebackers is they take really, really good angles. Like, Miles Graham, he takes really good angles when he has to go across the field to tackle a dude. Like, if he has to chase a dude down, like, he takes great angles to tackle that dude down. Like, you know, he, he just takes great angles, and, you know, that helps limit yards and limits the bleeding of the yards that are given up on the defensive end. When somebody gets a loose, a ball carrier gets a loose, a running back gets loose, or a wide receiver gets loose, or even a quarterback gets loose, you know? You know, it really helps stop the bleeding, so that's a really underrated thing. I think a lot of people don't see today. Uh, so, I mean, hey, that's a, that's a huge strength right there that I just wanted to point out because I saw that multiple times consistently throughout his tape. Um, and then, hey, now going into his running back, his running back strengths real quick. Um, and then, like I said, he had good speed and acceleration, like just right off the bat. Um, really good speed and acceleration, just able to shoot through gaps, explode through gaps. Once he sees the hole, he hits it. You know, like he's he's really quick with it. He like again, like awareness, like his awareness. You know, as an outside linebacker carries over to his running back ability. I'm not sure how much he's gonna play running back at the next level at Florida, uh, but I mean, either way though. I mean, if if you need a dude, if if I mean, hey. If you need somebody at Florida to run the ball, hey, he, he can definitely be capable of that. Um, the next, like, he has really good balance. And I'll talk about that in a second um, after I talk about this. He's really good at run the Wildcat. This is why I mentioned, like, if Florida needs somebody to run it, because if they need somebody to run the Wildcat, that's that's their guy. Like, he he really ran that Wildcat really good. Um, he, run, he runs really good. Um, his junior season, he did really well in that. Um, so, hey, man, I'm... I'm rooting for him on that. Or his, his sophomore season, my bad. 
um yeah i'm just rooting for him on that um that's that's a big thing right there um and then yeah like i said like even if he he doesn't even have to be like a you know rusher like that much like if they just needed somebody for the wildcat he's their guy um and just that balance goes along with it because he's great at breaking tackles as well and just keeping plays alive um so just his aggressiveness as a runner you know carries over to us off the linebacker or not off the line but outside linebacker i don't know what <laughs> okay uh but yeah like like i was saying though um yeah so that's a huge thing right there and then he's great at catching the ball at the backfield as well very versatile runner and catcher um kind of i'm not gonna say that but i mean hey he's he's versatile when it comes to the running game and the passing game so that's a big thing and yeah man that's that's the main things i saw from miles graham's film if you guys enjoyed this video on the new florida gators commit miles graham please hit the like button down below comment on this video what you thought of his strengths and what you know what i said and hey you know point out some things i missed and subscribe if you're new and we'll see you guys in the very next episode Peace.